revealed, the royal family's holistic health habits. The royal family might have a list of outdated rules and protocol but, when it comes to their health, they're actually quite trendy. Up ahead, we take a closer look at how the royal family uses homeopathy, plus some members most tried and true holistic health habits. How does the royal family use homeopathy? Homeopathy runs deep in the royal family. According to the late Peter Fisher, who served as of one the Queen's homeopathic doctors, Queen Victoria and Prince Albert introduced the alternative medicine to the royal family around 150 years ago. The founder of our hospital was Prince Albert's father's doctor, he told Naturally Savvy. There has been an official homeopathic physician treating the royal family since the 1930s, he noted. How does the royal family use homeopathy? While many modern members of the royal family don't shy away from traditional Western medicine, some of their everyday habits and home remedies stem from the homeopathic habits introduced to them by their ancestors. Find out how Queen Elizabeth, Meghan Markle, and other members of the royal family incorporate homeopathic treatments and practices into their wellness routine. Ahead, Queen Elizabeth replaces medicines with herbs. One of the biggest ways Queen Elizabeth incorporates homeopathic medicine into her wellness regimen is through supplements. Her Majesty allegedly prefers some natural herbal remedies over traditional medications. Meghan Markle received acupuncture throughout her pregnancy. As a Los Angeles native, it should come of no surprise that Meghan Markle believes in holistic habits to help her elevate her health. According to reports, the Duchess of Sussex has received acupuncture throughout her pregnancy. Meghan has been having regular acupuncture sessions to help her unwind and relax, a source revealed to Vanity Fair. It's brilliant for the blood circulation and boosting blood flow to the uterus. She plans to use acupuncture right up to her due date. They added, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle both allegedly received acupuncture treatments leading up to their royal wedding in May 2018. 2. Kate Middleton uses natural skin care oils. Holistic health habits don't stop at what you put in your body. In fact, one of Kate Middleton's tried and true remedies involves her skin care routine. The Duchess of Cambridge uses rose hip oil on her complexion which not only nourishes but has anti-aging benefits, as well. The Queen drinks a lot of tea. Like many British citizens, Queen Elizabeth doesn't shy away from tea. And, fortunately for her, her two favorite types of tea, Darjeeling and Earl Grey, have a lot of health properties. Darjeeling tea is rich in antioxidants, which can help keep the immune system in check, anti-age and more. Earl Grey is linked to better digestion and might also help keep anxious feelings at bay. Meghan Markle takes ashwagandha to manage stress. Like the Queen, Meghan Markle prefers herbal supplements. According to an interview with the chalkboard, the Duchess of Sussex takes ashwagandha, which is a type of adaptogen that can help manage stress. Meghan Markle also takes B12 drops, a multivitamin, magnesium, and a cortisol manager, aka the stress hormone, before bed. Kate Middleton takes ginger for morning sickness. When Kate Middleton was pregnant, she experienced severe morning sickness. As a way to combat nausea, she allegedly snacked on ginger cookies, which helped soothe her stomach. Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton practice yoga. Yoga is an important part of both Kate Middleton and Meghan Markle's routines. Both royal women incorporate yoga as a way to move their bodies, meditate, and spend some time inward, which can have a positive effect on the mind, body, and soul.